Hey guys, and welcome to today's video. So today, don't really know what we're doing right now. I'm just riding four wheeler, kind of riding around. Uh, it's like 10:30 or something. So that's really all I'm doing now. I'm trying to think of what we're doing today. Uh, my brothers just got out of school yesterday, finally. So now they'll be in the vlogs more often, and yeah. So we're just gonna ride around and do stuff whatever we want today let's get going So y'all, this is a Polaris Expedition 425. Um, it's I think it's a 2005. Um, this is the other four wheeler we have. I have another video on our on the Honda Rancher. This is the Polaris. I actually like this one a lot better. It's more powerful. It's got it's faster. Um, I've hit 50 with it. Um, and the, the cool things about it is it has the winch that comes in handy a lot it has really nice uh, headlights up front they're pretty bright um, hitch and everything so yeah five speed transmission so yeah it's actually a really nice four wheeler and mainly I just use the four wheelers to ride around in the summer um, sometimes we use them to do other things in the winter they haul firewood occasionally um, they're really nice for hauling deer out when we shoot them I uh, did that last year with one of them uh, the big thing is on Labor Day weekend we take them to the cabin same with the dirt bikes and I mean they get ridden we ride them so hard um, so it's really nice to have them up there um, but yeah fun uh it's a fun uh, four wheeler. Hi. feeding the steers like I do every day um, right now, it's actually really windy today ish like all that it's kind of crazy um, there's not a single cloud in the sky either um, it's not supposed to it's, it's it's nice weather we're swimming today but it's hot and windy which is it's kind of nice Pretty nice weather out. So uh, I'm gonna kinda just come over here, feed the steers. This is actually a cattle chute that we use to load cattle in the trailer. Just getting used to there. Huh? It looks like they haven't even been here to eat at all. All right, so we're good on feeding the steers. So out here, this is a new seating that we did we seeded some new grass in here two months ago. Um, actually, right here, there are about a hundred railroad ties buried under here. That's because this used to be a big pile of junk right here and we actually had a skid loader, dug a pit and buried it all. So we got reclaimed all this pasture here. Um, grass still needs to come in pretty good. R the water runoff ain't helping. 
on the steer's way down there. But uh, that's that, and uh, so we'll see how it goes. We're, it's fenced off with an electric fence right now, so the steers don't get in here and mess it all up. Down here, it's looking pretty nice in some of these areas. It's just, you could t right here, this is all runoff erosion. Hopefully it'll start picking up here soon. It is looking nice right here, up and through there. But hopefully it'll start picking up soon because we need to let, let them back in here, kind of-ish. Because they're being pinned up. They're restricted to where they can go, so, yeah.